I'm really asking you this. I'm curious. Yeah. This guy was watching you, man. Yeah. How, how do you feel about that? What's up, guys? Right here with Jesus and Fast Clean Mobile Detailing right here in the Watsonville area. And today we're going to do a silver detail with a add-on on steam cleaning and a uh, two-year coating for the trim, restoring it and protecting it. So let's get started. All right, Jesus, what are we doing in the works, man? What are we doing? So uh, we're doing a... This one is a, a silver package, uh, add on a steam cleaning on the interior. Uh, we'll be uh, carpeting seats, and then we're gonna go ahead and clean all the plastic, condition it, and then we're gonna go ahead and wash it, a thorough extra wash, and apply a paint sealant, which lasts two, two weeks. And then we're gonna go ahead and do um, the back trunk. Uh, we're gonna do a thorough cleaning, and then add a one-year um, plastic coating, which uh, restores, and we'll coat it just to keep it um, looking black all the time. Got it, how long should this job take you? Uh, this job should take about uh, an hour to two hours. So uh, I'm assuming two hours, just in case, um, since I have to apply the coating in the back. But let me see what you got over here. And what is this for? Uh, this is a C4 uh, trim restoration uh, oh. from G Technique. Oh. For to make the back shiny? Yeah, I mean back to restore the trim. Yeah. And then uh, it should look back to normal. Hey, Jesus, so we actually met the customer yes. somewhere else. Why didn't we go to his location? Um, we didn't go to his location because he lives in an apartment, and um, in apartments, they don't really let us work at that place, yeah. and there's not a lot of space um, in apartments. So, yeah, we had to meet um, in a different place. Do you always do that for this customer? Uh, for this customer, yes, uh, yeah. since he doesn't have a house or he doesn't have a place to to have the car cleaning, yeah. Oh, and, and then we went to a car wash? Yeah, to a car wash place. So they had a more bigger space and I mean, not a lot of cars, so. We blend in, bro. Yeah. No one's gonna <laughs> question it, you know? Yeah, they never knew, no one knew what happened. <laughs> hey, you actually had some people come up to you. Oh, yes. Yeah, right? Yeah, I had a lot of customers asking me about the service. So I think I got a lot of attention as well, so. People want to know about the service. Hey, so. you got to go there to get more business, Asus. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, bro, I'm really asking you this. I'm curious. Yeah. This guy was watching you, man. Yeah. How, how do you feel about that? Um, for right now, um, I feel, I mean, not really pressure. Back then, I used to feel really pressure. But now, I'm like, I'm just used to it now for the customer. Really? Uh, watching me what I'm doing um, but yeah back then it was like really pressure like I didn't even like people watching me what I'm doing because I feel like they were pressuring me but yeah. now it's like normal I'm just used to it now really I, I, yeah I get a lot of customers like that what advice do you have for detailers who still feel uncomfortable when somebody's watch? okay let me go back why do customers watch detailers to make sure they're doing the job right or are they like fascinated by it what do you think? I think because they just want to see what you're actually doing to their vehicle. They want to make sure that you're uh, cleaning it the proper way. Mm. Um, or they just want to get an idea like wh what you're doing to their car so they oh. can see like, oh, well, this guy is actually doing what he said, you know? So, I mean, they're just like, they're just curious. 
what you're doing to the vehicle. You got to tell them to go check out your YouTube channel. And yeah. You want to see what I do? Go give me, you know? Yeah, yeah. So right now I'm going to be like, yeah, you want to go see uh, what I do to your vehicle? Go check the YouTube channel and yeah. you can see a every little detail. There <laughs> you go. Yep. Hey, and uh, what advice do you have for new detailers? Uh, you know that I still get nervous. Uh, advice for new detailers, just, I mean, just do your thing. Like, just... Uh, focus on what you're doing. Don't focus on the client. Just focus on your work. Yeah. The reason I asked is because he was actually helping you to the yeah. detail. Did he want to help or you asked him, hey, homie, help me out real quick? Uh, he asked me to help. I mean, he wanted to do it because yeah. he wanted to learn how to do the pro proper washing. So, mm -hmm. I, I mean, I just say, okay. I mean, I, I wouldn't say accept it, but since he's kind of family, I just, I, I do, I just said join in. So it's okay. It. So the main part of this job was the ceramic coating, right? Uh, it was the, the main job of this work was the, yeah, the coating on the plastic. So we applied the trim coating uh, to restore the trim because his car had a lot of uh, faded trim. So that was the main focus to protect that. And what product did you use? I used uh, Jig Technique uh, C4. Uh, it's a restoration for trim. Hmm. How do you apply that? Uh, well, I, I mean, you apply it just, I mean, you use a, um, like a foam uh, pad just to make sure, uh, you, you just apply it by hand. Yeah. If this just apply by hand, just um, side to side, just making sure that you don't leave any um, dull spot. That's pretty and, much it. And how long is this protection? Uh, this protection lasts to a year to two years, uh, depending on the maintenance as well. So. Uh, it says two year, but I mean, I just say one year because we don't know how the customers can maintain it as well. Hey, so this this detail took a cool minute, man. Yeah. Why did it take so long? Uh, it took so long because um, it wasn't dirty. It just had a lot of details that we had to, I had to touch um, every little parts. It's not dirty. It's just the detail, like the the interior is. We were we were trying to get the the most cleaning that we can do in the interior as well the exterior so yeah it's just the little details that matter it didn't help that we were chit chatting bro i think laughing. <laughs> yeah i think um a lot of time we were talking i was talking to the customer he wanted to know i mean what was i doing and what every product did so that 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 um took a lot of time too and i know i don't normally do that but since some customer want to know i have to you know, I have to get them my way and explain them what I'm actually doing so they can know what, what they're getting and so they can value what I provide for them. There you go. This is how I do my silver package with the Atom Steam and the ceramic coating. Let me know in the comment below if you guys use a different coating. And if you want to see more content, don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll see you on the next one.